Hey, what's going on guys? It's Chuck Nader here, and today I would have for you guys yet another episode of DNA Bomb with Every Gun on Advanced Warfare. It's episode 19, and it is the Pi Take. Now, the Pi Take is one of the LMGs in Advanced Warfare. It's a little bit underused, uh, not as popular as the Ameli, but it is still pretty good. It's one of those where the first 10 or 12 bullets kind of have a, quite a bit of recoil, but after that, it turns into a laser, and the recoil pretty much completely disappears. So, definitely worth trying out. I believe there might still be a glitch in the game with the loophole variant of the Pi Take, where they made the stats different in the code than it displays on the screen so I think it you know I'm not as sure exactly what it does but I do know that the actual stats and performance of the gun are better than it shows on the screen so you guys should definitely try that out if you have that variant let me know if you like the pie take or not and hopefully enjoy the gameplay in the background it is part of a 50 gun streak but I didn't end up showing it you know this is only DNA bomb with every gun I might as well show you know just that little exciting part where I get the DNA now, in this video, guys, I'm going to talk about a little bit, you know, the future kind of and more plans uh, for that. And it's going to involve you guys quite a bit. And the, all the videos in the next coming, you know, weeks and days until I hit 10K are basically going to involve you guys a lot. So definitely make sure to tune in to every single day to see what I'm uploading because guaranteed, you know, probably every single one, if not 80, 90 percent, will be some sort of question, some sort of request to you guys. Uh, and I know I keep mentioning 10K, 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 but it's really hard for me not to, guys. I mean, you know, when I started YouTube, my original goal was to hit 10K. And obviously everyone's, you know, 100K, a million, 10 million, whatever. But, you know, when I started, I sat down and I said, I want to hit 10,000 subscribers. And here we are. And it's it's really amazing and it's exciting and I can't help being excited and, and just happy that you guys are here, that you're all subscribed to me and all that kind of thing. So thank you for that. Thank you for all your support again. But along with 10K, you know, 10K is a sizable channel, in my opinion. You know, five, eight, five digits, that's, that's a lot. That's a lot of people. So I, wanna, I don't want to shift the focus of my channel, but my channel is going to be changing a little bit in the sense of it's going to be more probably entertainment oriented and focused. You know, I've made plenty of commentaries about how, you know, the gameplay aspect is not really, you know, it'll get you so far, but not much farther than that. So I really want to, you know, try to shift my channel so that it, we can just keep on growing and keep getting more people to come on over and subscribe and enjoy the videos. So with that will come a lot of questions to you guys in terms of what you want to see and you guys will pretty much be shaping the future of my channel. So. The one thing I wanted to ask about today was what to do kind of in the near future with uh, DNA Bomb with Every Gun, because I have pretty much finished it. You know, I don't have the MDL, I don't have the Ride Shield, but those don't really count to begin with anyway, in my opinion. You know, I haven't really tried for the secondaries, I probably will go for them, but let me know what I should do after DNA Bomb with Every Gun. DNA Bomb with Every Elite? Double DNA Bomb with Every Gun? You know, I'd like to know. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to drop a like if you did. My name is Instructinator, and I'm out. Peace.